Windows icons, they look the same over a decade. And let's be honest, they are overdue for an upgrade. But if you have ever tried customizing them, it probably runs into tools that are risky, messy, and straight up break your system. In this video, I'm going to show you how to safely transform your Windows icons. No 7TSP, no system patching, no breaking involved. Just a clean tool, a beautiful icon pack, and a lightweight mod that makes the magic happen. Stick around because by the end of this video, your window setup will look completely refreshed and the best part is I'll be able to undo everything safely. Just a few clicks. Let's get into it. Here is what we are starting with. The classic windows icons, the looks, the Rex. We are using a tool called Rainhawk, a lightweight open source and doesn't mess with your system files like 7TSP does. Seriously, it's the safest way to mode Windows visuals right now. If you don't have this tool installed, just head to the official website which is windhog.net, unload it and install. Once you have this mod installed, you are going to see the official homepage which is going to look similar to this. And to get these custom icons, we have to install a mod called resource director. So we can search it over here and you are going to see this resource director here. Just click on details and here what you have to do is to click on install and accept risk and install. Once we have it installed, you are going to see resource director icon themes over here. Just click on it and it's going to direct you to their site which is going to hold all the icon packs we are going to use. So there are a whole lot of icon packs over here and you can see they are very plenty and beautiful. So now what we have to do is to find the one that we like and just download and install it on our computer with ease. So if you want to go with any icon packs over here, what you have to do is just find the name of the icon. So I'm just going to go with this sweet rainbow. And here what I'll do is I'll just go to the top of the page and here I'll click on resource director teams. So here what you have to do is to look for the team you want. So I wanted to download Sweet Rainbow. So here it is and I'll click on it. And here what I'll do is to just click on this download to download. Once it's downloaded, I'll just open the folder which contains that and I'll open it up. And we are going to see this folder inside. What we have to do is to find a safe place on our computer, which is mainly the local DXC, and create a folder here, or you can just drag it over here. But what I recommend is to just create a new folder, which you can call mods, and open it up and drag this folder inside it. Once you have it here, we are good to go. So now we can just head to our resource director. And here, what we have to do is to head to the settings and we are going to see team folder here where we have to put the folder of our team over here. So what I'll do is to just come back and what we are going to do is to open it up and here, let's copy the folder path and paste it inside your team folder bar. So I'll paste it here and click on save. And the magic is when we head to our taskbar to restart our explorer, is going to change the look of our explorer so i'll just click on the windows explorer here and restart and look at that wow now we just swapped out all the default icons without breaking a single thing no restart no rebuild no regrets this works for folder icons this pc recycle bin everything and if you ever want to go back you just have to head to your resource directory and just disable or delete the mod clean safe and fully reversible now you can see my icons has been back to the default one without restart or anything and if you find this video helpful just drop a like and subscribe to the channel